this time I felt like let's let's just start with research and see what that research where it wants to take us and where it wants to guide us. So I'm interested in kind of creating a choreographic frame or a situation where what is revealed is their point of view. How do we deconstruct even my role as a choreographer in this space? Um, I come from a history of also being an interpreter and through making work I realized it's, it's these collective voices and the meeting of those voices and the tensions that happen and, and the collective questioning that I, I find really interesting. So yeah, this is the Andrea Penn and artist and artist is so important because it's not me, it's me and them. De pouvoir aller analyser les choix que Laura va faire dans certaines situations, puis les choix que François va faire dans certaines situations. On n'a pas souvent ce cadeau-là de temps, justement, pour juste vraiment faire ça, apprendre à se connaître dans des, euh, dans des systèmes de recherche assez simples. Yeah, so we're trying to approach this as a design studio, so using the post-its, and those post-its are kind of like words that they generated based on what they know of the work in previous years. So kind of really opening up the intellectual, conceptual, and both like physical discussion about what's happening, what's feeling. Like it takes time to chill away and to really be able to articulate what is your language and I think this is what we're doing here there's post-it notes because we're working a lot with language we're trying to distill and understand definitions and be find clarity in what it is I think like also with the huge break during COVID there is a sense of reconnecting with the act of being together in with a creative goal it was maybe strange at first but it doesn't feel like we're making a COVID creation to be honest it could also be because it's such a big space. We can really use a lot of space to kind of get back into being together. That, yeah, it's just a really precious space to be in. I think not only, like Laura said, are we in a place of questioning and defining, but we're also in a place of just even re-questioning our practice as choreographers, as artists, not just in this work, but in general. Um, so I think there's a preciousness to this week that we might not find it the second time we meet, you know? I just want people to know this feeling of like deep vitality and energy and renewal that like shot through my body when I got back into this kind of work and with these people and in a studio and all these things like there are things missing from our lives that we're gonna get back, I think.